So we're at Empanada House. A good history of this place is that it's found by Ben and Monica. Ben is from Romania and Monica is from Colombia. So the whole upstairs is a milk tea slash coffee house and they also incorporate in their menu fusion empanadas. They also have other things such as like juices, hot teas. So when I say fusion empanadas, I mean that these empanadas, they represent different countries such as the bulgogi one represents the Kore um, Korean cuisine. There's a Hungarian goulash one, and then there's a traditional beef one, which would probably fall under the Colombian culture. Personally, my favorite, my favorite empanada would be the pulled pork one because it has this guava barbecue sauce in it, and it's very unique um, compared to the other ones that I've already tried. My second favorite would probably be the traditional beef. Traditional beef actually tastes really good despite the name of just being traditional. So being here, we were able to try three of the dessert empanadas. We tried the Nutella banana one, the guava cheese, and the fig mascarpone. Out of all of them, the most unique in my opinion would be the guava cheese. It has a very unexpected texture. The guava and the cheese actually really do complement each other well, but the texture was just a bit um, offsetting. Big mascarpone was actually my favorite. It was really sweet and it tasted like kind of a like a breakfast pastry. And the ban banana Nutella, it's a pretty good, you know, all around kind of favorite flavor. It, in my opinion, it was really good, but it was just, it's pretty common for a dessert. Currently, they have the soft opening and their grand opening will be on February 1st. The whole feel of the restaurant I think it's a pretty good idea, it's a pretty good concept. It's on top of another restaurant, which I think is also really cool because they have desserts. So they're still going to be bringing in people even if people choose not to dine in on the top restaurant. I think it's pretty awesome that they were able to bring like milk teas and empanadas together. They, they kind of, I can see them definitely complimenting each other, mostly with the desserts. Okay, definitely check out this place because it's actually pretty cool. The food is actually really good. Um, they will have their grand opening February 1st. Right now it's just a soft opening. Be sure to check out their address, it's down below. And I hope you enjoy this place as much as I do.